Well, hey guys, really nice to have you here again. This video is gonna cover the MX-1 mixer and the effects side of it specifically. I'm gonna do three videos. This is the first, and this one we're gonna cover the filter and tone controls in the mixer itself. So let's get stuck into it. Okay, so we've got this. This is just a Roland SEO2. We need to turn off the effects, so it's just... Nice, right, okay. So let's have a look at the filter. So we go into tone control here, and we're going to select the tone button. And on the display, you'll see FL1. FL1 is a low pass and high pass filter built into one. So when we use this tone control, you use the actual tone filter knob here on the mixer. So let's bring this into the middle where it is off and let's have a listen to it on the low pass side of things. So let's just hit a note. Now let's have a listen to the high pass side. Now just so you know, that is an analog synth and that's a digital filter. It's actually, we shouldn't be banging the camera, but here we go. All right, now let's have a listen to filter two, so FL2. Filter two is another low pass and high pass filter, but this time with an increased resonance in it. So let's try again into the middle. Okay, now let's listen to the high pass. What's all the way? Okay. Let's have a listen to TN1 or Tone 1. Tone 1 is a volume of low frequency and a high frequency region. So basically we change that region. All right, so let's try it out. So down the low end, it's boosting a bass and up the top end in those high ends. Okay, let's try Tone 2. Tone 2 is just a variation of Tone 1. Let's try that again. So it's probably a little bit more beefy. Let's try, let's add a few other instruments in here. Let's try this. Okay, so you can see Tone 1 and Tone 2 are pretty much just like a bass and treble old sort of style tone control. Next is Low 1 or EQ. Um, what it does is it, it gives you a volume of low frequency region that's changed. So let's try that out. You try it on a high note.
Yeah, it really boosts that low end. Okay, let's try low two. I think it's low two. Oh wow, that really boosts that low end there. The seventh one we've got here is high, which does the opposite, so that boosts the high sounds. And high two does the same, except it's a variation of this one. Probably a little bit more subtle. A little bit more subtle there. All right, so we've up to isolator now which is IS1 isolator 1 which is a low frequency and high frequency region that are cut so let's try this out so that's cutting the high frequency to the left and on the right it's cutting the low frequency nice and let's try isolator 2 which is pretty much low, mid and high. So let's try this one. Okay. Now we get to the 11th setting. Now we've got to hold the tone button there's the tone button and we've got to turn the value and that's how we get to filter three now this is an addition to one of the uh, firmware updates I believe so this gives you filter three let's try that one out That's an extremely aggressive filter, that one. So that could be really cool in some sort of drum type sound. Let's get the drums going again. Whoa, the bottom end on that is crazy. That is just crazy. And filter four, which is the next one. Filter four is the resonant low pass and high pass with an increased resonance. So let's try this one out. very very harmonic that one so they're the two bonus ones in there just remember if you want to access those you can't access them by just adjusting the value you have to hold down tone and you get those two extra ones there okay guys so one last thing to remember is that this mixer has a thing called a scene memory and if you want to set up scenes for different layouts you can store these filter settings and these tone settings in your scenes and it will remember those and literally all you have to do is hold down store and press one of the buttons up there and that's it you've now got your scene memory stay tuned for the next video the next video is going to be on the beat effects side of the mixer so It'll be out soon. I'll catch you then.